and, and it's really, it's really interesting, interesting to see how, see how uh, Taiwan, Taiwan has, has such a different, and different and diverse, uh, influence, influence during this during period. During this period. Uh, uh, I would like, I would maybe, like maybe in the end, the end when, when we, we have, we have a session, session that you could you talk, talk to us, to us a little bit about the Dong University, University campus, campus and the buildings, and the buildings and the and the process of, of uh, that, that is, that is, is very current and going, going on the, on the protection, protection of campus. Defensive uh, buildings and factories as well. 
So, so uh, um, we can still see now, see now, see now, see now, see nowadays, uh, even though, even though what has, what has been going through, going through a, a lot of uh, land recognition, and still, and still the, the original, original landscape, the original uh, uh, historical uh, area, still remains still remain intact. intact. So this so is, this is Macau, Macau 20th century, century. In, the in the modern days. And uh, uh, this is a map. map. Uh, you, can uh, you can see the, the original, original area, area is still here. here. So in 2005, so the historical center has uh, been described by the World, World, World Heritage List. And, uh, and uh, the historic, historic center of Macau means not just a building, not just a St. Paul or a church. church. It means, it means an entire urban, urban landscape, urban public, public connected, connected together. together. Area. So, it means so it means 22, 22 architectural villas and, and also 8 public plaza, plaza in the blue area. area. And also, and also the connecting pathways in the of the road as well. So it is this actually a connection, connection. not, uh, not uh, just a single building. So, so this, this map, map is a little bit, uh, uh, little bit introduction. Uh, uh, just to say that it's been a very long time. Uh, for, for more than 400, 400 years, and the uh, uh, city has not been stopped. It has been, it has been progress, progress, evolution, evolution progress, progress and development, development in, the, in, the in the past. So, so now, now uh, when you, when you talk, talk about the establishment, establishment of legal framework, legal framework uh, for, uh, for order protection, 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 protection work, will not, will not work without a legal boundary, a legal framework. So. We all know that the heritage production now came out uh, in, uh, in 2014 and became effective. And, uh, and before, before then, actually, in Macau, Macau, there has, there has been a lot of uh, legal, legal registration, registration already, already involved in the past. In the past. So, so I hope I will uh, uh, you, <laughs> you a little bit further because we are going to talk about the history, 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 history in the past. And just to say that the government has been doing a lot of work in the local society as well. Before uh, Macau returned to China, or even before the, uh, uh, the historical center became listed as the research. So in 1953, there was, there was a committee set up uh, to start investigation. And then, and then in 1976, the first actual law about the protection, the heritage protection, came out. And then in 1984, the first heritage list has been came out. So you see on the map on the right, it is the first list, and that's only on the Panasonic side. And the government at the time identified a certain buildings at the time to put that into the list. So that was the first list. And then in 1992, uh, the second list, not, not the second, the second list, list, I mean the additional, additional list, uh, combined, uh, combined with the first one. Uh, they they further, further into a type and the following as well. As well. So, so we have more, more buildings, buildings to go, on, go onto the list, and then, and then with uh, with additional, additional, additional supplement, supplement uh, to, 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 to be more, to look into the Macau, to look into a more general, into more entire area. So, so this is the this list, is the list uh, in 1992, the full list is still in use today, uh, even though, even though uh, 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 the production law has already came out in 2014, so this list is still uh, in, uh, inactive. Uh, this list uh, actually consists of four uh, different categories. So unlike the UK or Hong Kong, they talk, uh, they, they say grey or the grey talk in UK, they don't grey, uh, we don't grey like this. Uh, we, we, talk, we say this is a certain category. So there are four categories, uh, classifications. In terms of monuments, like the churches, like the St. Paul's, like the temples. Etc. Et and also, also the, the, the architecture with artistic, artistic value and the sets of groups of buildings <coughs> such as the San Rosario, near our office, office and the IC office. And also the, and also the size of the urban areas, areas the gardens, gardens as well. So the list, so the list totally includes 128, 128 items so at the moment. And, uh, and uh, uh, that includes 417 buildings of architecture and that is the protection zone. Including 3.17 uh, uh, square meters. Uh, 
Yeah. Square, square kilometers, that's a typing mistake. Three point one square kilometers, actually. And that's and about 10% of the cow. And of course, and of course I, I should mention, mention it in 2005, the Stroper Center became a part of the World Heritage List. And because of that, the government kind of additionally put in 2016, they put a buffer zone. In the, in the, in the surrounding, surrounding the World Heritage Area of the Historic Center. So, so as, you can as you can see, as you can see, as you can see the, the, original the original list we used today, used today and then they put the pink, pink area as the, as the as a buffer zone. So the buffer so zone, zone, zone is not actually the list of buildings. The buildings. Uh, uh, they are actually the providing, providing the area, providing, providing the buffer function. function. To the list of monuments and so on. And so, on. So, on. So, so then, then this, is this is the map we use today, today uh, even in our office, to the, to the, the in the Ocean Bowl, Ocean Bowl too. Yeah. And in 2008, as people may remember, there were some high rise developments surrounding the White House area. So, the government announced a new dispatch to control uh, uh, certain building heights uh, in, uh, in those areas, areas surrounding the White House. So uh, you see the same one, two, three, four, two, three, eleven, and they, and they have uh, different, different heights limits uh, in that in those zones. zones. So as I mentioned, in 2013, and then the uh, first law has been drafted, uh, the first proper law of the cultural heritage has been drafted. And then, and then uh, it became, became effective, effective, in effective in 2014. Uh, and that is, that is a, a huge improvement compared to the past. Because, because uh, before, before this, this law, law uh, we are only talking about the physical buildings. We are talking only about, about the uh, architecture. architecture. But, but with this law, actually, actually we are talking about cultural, cultural heritage, uh, which means uh, intangible heritage uh, as well. Activities, festivals, and, and this is all, this is all uh, mentioned, mentioned in this, in this law as well. As well. Even, the trees, Even the trees, you know, before, before there were no list, 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 list trees, trees but nowadays, but nowadays we have. So, so in 2013, the big improvement is this one. This one? Uh, uh, Dominions that is, that is uh, given by the IC. Because, because uh, before, this before this law, uh, the IC opinions, the cultural affairs, only issue the advisory to the, to, to the other uh, uh, departments, like the OP. They have, they the, have the right to put our opinions away. But after them, after this law, law, and then we, we issue, uh, uh, the, IC the IC start to issue funding and revenue and revenue, which is compulsory. Which is which compulsory. Which means, uh, which means uh, from, 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 from the cultural, cultural point of view, uh, the listed, the listed area, area uh, especially, especially the listed areas, areas and we, start we start to have a stronger, stronger uh, strength, strength in terms of, in terms of legal, the legal, legal, uh, legal uh, requirements to the to certain developments in these areas. So as I mentioned, so as I mentioned there's, there's been a lot of changes uh, uh, after this law came out uh, from, uh, the from the government point of view, and the uh, span, uh, span has been increases, increases. Especially, especially in terms of, terms of the listed heritage. Uh, before uh, they were only about talking about religious, religious buildings, public buildings, Western residents, but then gradually moving into the Chinese residents, the Jenga Mandarin House, the Wuhan Mansion, or even, or even some, some of the lists, list, uh, some, some of the buildings are not, that, know, was, that not was not originally on the list. On the list. I mean, I mean uh, 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 the buildings the, the the outside zone, basically. basically. And, 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 and on the other side, outside, it looks from the outside, from the outside uh, of the buildings, buildings into, the into the inside, into the, into the content. Because before, because before the government mainly, most of the time, of the time before, the, before, the, before the law, uh, we only uh, do, do the exterior facade, uh, uh, do the maintenance of the facade, but not the inside. We, most, of most of the time we didn't really care about the inside at the time. But then, but then nowadays we move, move, to move, move, further, move further into the inside. But the connotation, what, what does it mean by the by the atmosphere, the atmosphere, we don't want the scale, we want the content as well. 
So, so after, after, after this one, we, we, we visited the area, into the area like, like this one, this one. Uh, uh, putting more putting functions, functions into the, into the inside, inside the building. The building. So, before so before it's the exterior, exterior work. work. Uh, uh, this is before the work came out. For example, in the square, there were, there were a lot of people and signage. And, 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 and then later on, we need to have to work with the developers and also the owners of the buildings. And we can train it. And then we laid out a clear rule for everyone to follow. Special guidelines for this kind of advertising of the works. And then we, and we also do look a little further into the, the uh, restoration of the facade of the buildings, including the roof as well, using the traditional material and also, and also the, the uh, technique, technique and using the time. Uh, because uh, because uh, the, the paint we use, the modern paint we use today, is believed to be not very good for the traditional buildings, for the big walls. Uh, it, is uh, it is not the concrete, concrete. They, are they are not, they are not originally built in concrete, they are very good. So, when you paint a wall, there is a certain requirement for a special paint to be used to allow the original rules to be briefing, to be, you know, vibrating, usually, to let the air in and let the air out as well. As I mentioned, uh, it's about the inside, the inside of the building well. as well. We, we kind of look into the originality. Uh, uh, what is the true story about this place? place. So, so there are for different, for different locations, we uh, to look into, to look into the northern atmosphere, what is the original, the original function, function the original, the original uh, uh, decoration of the space. So we can so see it from the Mandarin house, from the car mansion, from some churches, from, churches, from the meeting general mansion as well. So this is, so this uh, is uh, a space you can see some of the ongoing pleasure we are doing at the moment. Uh, uh, Except on the facade, we walk into the interior, and you can, you can see from the pharmacy train side, uh, which is going to open very soon, uh, at the end of this year, hopefully we can make it. And the uh, patio as well. And the loop 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 the loop is open. open. We, uh, uh, we shape the interior into the, the original, uh, uh, original, original atmosphere. And also, we would like to introduce the not introduce actually, to be encouraging people to go into the space to use it as what it was, what it has been before. So this is some this is examples, examples uh, uh, of the projects, projects that, that is uh, that are outside, outside the zone. Uh, uh, they, these buildings are not listed. For example, the, the library, library in the, in the, the, in the harbor, the Sunny Tower, the Pantheon in the building area. This is privately owned, private owner. They are not under government, but we move in. Even though, even though this is not on the list, on the list we, we communi communicate, negotiate with the other owner, and they, and they rent, the rent the property to us, so that, so that uh, we can renovate and generate the space uh, to, uh, give to give it a life to the buildings, to, to encourage local users to, 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 to encourage the public to use the building, basically. So, so this, this library is, is, is going to open next week, next week okay. I think. And, uh, and, uh, by the end of this year, year we we everyone can go to see it as well. Uh, as, you as you can see, as I mentioned, uh, we use some we modern, some modern technique, 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 concrete, uh, to, use uh, to use most of the space. Of the space. Um, there, are there are seven intact uh, structures, structures, actually. And then, and then the, the, the those, those ones on the right, on the right uh, Behind, behind, I mean behind the, the facade, structure the structure has been very bad when they moved in. The area was a very wet area. Uh, it's always, there's always, there's always been flooding. So the structure so wasn't very good, 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 especially when it was used in timber uh, before. So we, so we, 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 we try to keep as much as original structure as we can. 
uh, 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 no, those, those two buildings, buildings on the left, we, we, we had, had a successful job to, to, to keep the, to keep the to original, original uh, internal structures. For example, For example as you can see, these uh, uh, columns, columns are actually, are actually original. original. We have, uh, uh, we have, uh, we have uh, used the reinforced uh, way uh, uh, by, by metal, metal and uh, uh, bolts, screws, screws to, to strengthen, strengthen the, the structures because it was very bad. It was, it was, it was uh, flooded before, but then uh, uh, we, we kept it, kept it. Uh, but, uh, for, but the for the rest we couldn't because even those uh, uh, matter how much modern technology we they use they are, they are more damaged unless, unless we, 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 we rebuilt it by the traditional, traditional technique. But however, because of the uh, uh, new function of the building, building uh, uh, it's going to be a perfect space. Perfect space. So, so we kind of enlarge the, I mean, uh, 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 remove the internal walls and the partition to make a larger space to make it become a larger organization. And for the eating area, area, area is a different story because this one, uh, this project, we, we kept the original uh, atmosphere. Um, in terms of the restoration principle, we want to, to, to keep it as true as it was at the time. And this is and another, another non-mystic building uh, in the Arab area. And uh, it's, it, it, it was a ship now before for the maintenance work. And, then, and um, so we are, we are working on it at the moment, we already, already finished the stereo restoration. Uh, it was belong to the government, uh, the custom office before, but then now today it, it has been given to the IC, the cultural affairs. We are going to use it to encourage uh, the, the uh, creative industry and also for the exhibition space too. And, uh, and uh, the, the first building will be open very soon, I think it's by the end of this year too, as I love what to do this year. This year. And, uh, but then, but then, uh, but then, but then, then it is uh, is uh, is industrial uh, uh, building, so we want so to keep it as an industrial way of zeros, even though it's not listed. So, the concept, the concept have been changed, changed. Uh, it was about the historical relics of these buildings, and then, and then we, we, uh, we uh, summarized uh, everything uh, into a cultural heritage. So, so and also, and also, as I mentioned, mentioned it's not about buildings as well, as well. It's, it's about movable, 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 movable things like the glass, like the valuable objects. objects. And intangible, and intangible, like the festival like activities, like the Archa festivals, festivals. And, and archaeology as well, as well. Also, also the old trees. So, so these, are these are all mentioned in the, the, in the heritage collection so, so we talk, we talk about, about festivals, the festivals and this is all now as uh, listed festivals to encourage the certain culture to be maintained and then to be passing on generations so that they can be uh, move forward and, and, and remain, remain as the next generation to come. Including music, music, music and, dragon and dragon dance. So, so uh, just, uh, mention just mention a little bit about the regeneration and reuse. And there's, and a there's a certain certain debate, certain debate has been going on, right on in there. Is it, is it when, when you use the, use the old buildings? Um, does that mean? Does that mean it is still a it historical, historical building, building, or is it when you use a modern technique in the in old buildings? Uh, does that mean modern, or, or, is, or is it still heritage? So there's a, so there's a question still being asked, asked today. Uh, uh, the, the idea is to, uh, at some point uh, at some in Macau, Macau uh, especially, especially 10 years before, before the handover, uh, the, uh, the economy was, uh, was very bad, and some of the and buildings have been abandoned. And, uh, and uh, when the when city the city has been developed, uh, the, uh, radical the radical developments in society, especially, especially in the last 10 years, there has been a lot of changes. So, how do we how do we keep these buildings? For those, they are listed. This is why they are listed. This is it's going to be always to be there. But for those. For those, buildings for those buildings that are, that are not listed, are not, are not, not currently on the list, what do we do with them? So, so uh, the, uh, idea the idea is, is, idea is to uh, is basically, basically the same as the heritage that's not represented frozen 
certain, certain period. period. It, it cannot be stuck. Okay. It, it, sometimes, it sometimes it has to be used. It has, it has architecture, architecture has to be used, used. Uh, so that it, so is, that it is alive. Uh, uh, and, and so we should provide so provide certain benefits to society during the process of the development in different periods. So, as, so as you can see, some before, before in, the past, in the past years, the churches, years, the churches has, been has been used, and then, and then uh, for, for, for what about the next 400 years? So, so that's, 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 that's ideas to be at the moment in the IC is to uh, so how do we keep them alive? Them alive? Not, just not just the skin of the building, not just the outside. How do we keep the function of the building alive? Even though some, some functions may not be applicable today, today. maybe some, 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 some something else, maybe some, some, some other functions to be regenerate the, 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 the skin and the bones of the, of the buildings. So in terms so of, of the uh, architectural heritage, heritage there, so yeah, they are the for, for, for some point for, for some people it's, it's, the it's the resource. It's the with certain, certain characters. And what and we can cooperate uh, with the modern requirements, what they can if they can adapt uh, to, uh, to the certain requirements today and and, and to <coughs> become more a more sustainable uh, development. So so what we do what we believe is the Used, used uh, to, uh, to uh, for example, uh, for example um, this is a pawn shop, a pawn shop uh, uh, in the uh, Samalo. Uh, uh, it, 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 it has been a uh, uh, pawn shop uh, since, uh, since uh, the 1970s, but then it, but then has, it has been abandoned. In 1993, it has not been used. So, so people moved people away, the way and then the developer just didn't have enough resource to keep it going. Then the government moved in. Uh, establish a, a certain agreement with, a, with, a, with, a, with, the with the owner, and then, and then, and then we clean the, the space, space, and then, and then have it in the in 2003, so that people so can, can still, still go in and see the original, see the original, uh, original, original function and atmosphere of the building. These are some of the features before and after features. Some of the areas we have to be very careful and precise what it was before and then what we have to keep today. This is some other examples. And building the restoration project has won the UNESCO Award of the Cultural Heritage Conservation in 2004. And uh, except uh, uh, the point shop, we have other projects, successful projects too. Uh, uh, this is the in the, in the South Lazaro area, area uh, from the and um, before it was before a residential, 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 uh, uh, residential, uh, residential buildings, buildings, and now and it is uh, music school uh, today. today. And uh, this is the uh, Eton General Manson, I was mentioning. Before it was used by the news of school. And then the uh, school moved out at some point. And then worked with the government. And then the. For this project, we have a very successful story of the owner because the owner of the of the building uh, actually have got in touch with the eating uh, descendants. Uh, they work with their the grandsons, and the grandsons provide, provide us a lot of materials at the time. So we, so we kind of uh, display the story and then and make it an exhibition space to show the living, living condition at the time, and then and also the architecturally and to show the, to show original, the original, original, original space, space and uh, as it was, was before. Because when we moved in, and when, it was when, used was when, used when the building was used, used by the school, Peter's owner, um, they, they kind of, kind of uh, undergo a little bit of uh, restoration, restoration remodel. So, 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 so some of these are demolished and some has been changed. And some of these construction has been added, of course. But then when we move in, at some point we kind of struggled to understand the original building. But then after a series of research, after the eating family provides us some materials, we kind of successfully restored the building. As originally. And uh, this is the pawn shop, as I mentioned. 
So in terms of the I see what we do today is this is a very challenging as I mentioned just now for this project. Um, we had a lot of uh, difficulties to in terms of research and also in terms of investigation. Um, we have to work with the other uh, government departments like the OP. Uh, they sometimes they have some very also joints to show what it was before, to show the progress of the, of the building has been changed. But then we have to be more patient when we go on site, because not every time we are not very lucky. It took us nine years to do the Mandarin house. And uh, there, there were more, more than 200 families in the, in the house. So, so it was a very, was a very uh, complicated, uh, complicated uh, situation, uh, situation inside, inside that house. house. And then we, and then we carefully, carefully study the structure, structure and the structure that they, they, they use at the time. At the time. And we saw the building. So it was before. And there was, and there was, there was, there was a, a lot of uh, many, like old many old buildings, and, buildings and, 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 and old projects, old projects they and they have a lot, lot of installation, installation and, and additional, additional structure. structure. That may that affect your judgment inside because we don't, don't know what is added or what is original at some point. Still, we went through some difficult periods. And that was the area area in the 1960s. And then before the conservation, and after the restoration work, and again, before and after. So the technique so has, has, has to be scientific nowadays. Um, in terms of the modern techniques we use, we are not just using concrete sometimes, we are using chemicals, we are using minerals, painting sometimes. So we have to analyze, we have to monitor the material we have to try, try sometimes. But there are certain attempts, uh, but we always have this principle in science. How significant it was? Is it on the incentive? Is it run? Is, is it safe? Those are the principles we have to follow sometimes. And then, and then uh, uh, for example, you just free the scanner to the modern equipment, the modern, modern tools to, to, uh, to, uh, to monitor the uh, facade, because it's, 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 it's a very and important, 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 important monument in Macau. And then, of course, and then of course some recording. Some recording. So they so they also the, also the uh, uh, using uh, some, uh, some modern, modern uh, chemistry, chemistry to simulate and to, to formulate, formulate the original the materials we use. For example, the Chunambong wall, the Grand Earth, that we used in, in some of the defensive, defensive walls. And also, and also you can see some uh, uh, foundations uh, they used in the old time in the past. past. So, so, if you look at this next time, when you walk past, you can see some, some of the work we have finished, uh, just to just repair a certain, a certain bit. And then, of and course, then of course other some other, uh, uh, try to be modern, but still traditional technique uh, is, uh, is the salt evaluated uh, removal, removal and the dam cross insulation at the same dormitory. Well. So this so is this because, of because of the, uh, scientifically, scientifically uh, and theoretically, uh, there are some uh, underground water evaporate, 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 evaporate uh, upwards, so that it so is, that it is uh, so, that so that sometimes the water in the foundation is absorbing the salt, the salt, the salt, the salt in, this in this water. So and that, so that would cause damage, cause damage to the to the to the structure of the traditional houses architecture too. So, so the way we, the way we use we use it, we do now is to buy something, something like an injection, injection like like you do with the doctor, doctor uh, with the doctor, uh, uh, injecting the, the salt chemicals the into the wall, and then, and then when the chemical react to the, react to the salt inside this wall, and then the wall the wall will be the salt could be removed. So that the, so the, the wall can that's the material that's the material they use in Venice as well. As well. And also the and line wash, uh, uh, some of the 
traditional, uh, traditional technique, technique uh, mixing uh, by mixing with certain minerals for the paint on the wall. And this technique is used on the uh, library, library, actually. When you see the, you see the, uh, the, uh, the library in the library, 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 the Sanitao library, library, library uh, because, because uh, the minerals, the minerals are traditionally, uh, traditionally uh, we, cannot we cannot mix too bright or too, bright or too sharp colors uh, to be uh, used to like what we use, the right colors or like things we use today. today. I don't know the name of Yu Gao Chat. It's different it's to the Yu Gao Chat today. And uh, uh, the technique we use is very traditional. Very traditional. This, kind of this kind of line, of line wash is to allow, is to allow the air, air to breathe, uh, 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 the water to breathe, uh, uh, to be more, to let the water more evaporate more easily. But as I mentioned, it's, it's not just about our work. It's, it's, uh, with a successful protection uh, in the society, uh, we always require uh, not, not just the government, but also the society, and then also the owner of the of these buildings. They work together. But uh, sometimes, uh, sometimes we have some problems, like uh, when you just mentioned, they have some questions about uh, some 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 problem about uh, listing the certain buildings to to uh, to, uh, to have some challenges. So we are so trying to promote as well heritage uh, exhibition, like the publication as well. We're trying to be spreading the songs in the schools and to let them know what we are doing. We done some publication about the heritage as well, and also organize some workshops on site. Uh, in some archaeological areas like to let the public understand more about the history and the cultural heritage area. Uh, area. And also established the uh, embassy program, program which started in 2001, and, uh, and uh, it is organized by a group of uh, students and uh, uh, younger generations, so that they can so pass on the, they can talk the, the stories to their parents, to their parents too, <laughs> and also and the festivals, of course. Uh, to, uh, put to put activities more activities alive, alive activities, activities uh, into, uh, into uh, the old buildings, into the olden older atmosphere, and also there's some natural array as well. And of course, of course this, Sunday, this Sunday there's a Latin Latin array as well. To make the to make the human to make the humanity, humanity to, make to, to make the, the, the buildings, buildings more humanity, humanity actually. actually. So, uh, so as I mentioned, as I mentioned we have to work with the uh, uh, certain uh, owners of the, of the of the house, we as we are aiming, aiming and to bring bring the buildings alive, back to life, back back to life and we can, can save. Uh, we uh, encourage the accessibility to the public, but also, also we want to, want to let the owners understand that, that uh, try not to, try not to uh, uh, overuse for commercial and exploitation for buildings. And then, as mentioned, as mentioned in the, law, uh, the, government, the government can establish a certain agreement with the owners to render the open buildings to use the buildings if they are willing to. Are willing to um, there were some, there were some successful cases, cases uh, but also, uh, but of course, there are some not very happy ending cases. So, cases. so, um, so, um, so uh, uh, I already show, I already show you some successful cases, cases in, in some uh, uh, in some areas in Macau. For example, this is also Mi Tong. This is privately owned. And it was a school before, and now it is going to be a public building to be open to public. To be used as the heritage display or exhibition center. You see this from the old right, from the right, from the image on the right. It's a old building and a modern structure. And together, they live. And also the national exhibition room as well. The old buildings and then the new addition, modern structure next to it. And of course, library. As I mentioned, the interior as well. So, so the, objective the objective is to, is to 
inherent, inherent to, the buildings. to the buildings, uh, even, uh, though, even uh, though some, uh, some of them are very old, 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 some of them are very traditional, and, 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 and heritage cannot be uh, left, there alone left there alone and then abandoned for a very long time. For a very long time. So we try so to, try to encourage people to use it, to use it and we think and we think, we think how, we be, how we should be, and we think is there any other way that we can bring this bring these buildings alive. Um, it is not necessary to, to say demolish all the buildings, buildings sometimes. Uh, maybe, uh, we maybe we can keep it there, keep it there or maybe some, some, parts. some parts. So, 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 that, the next so that the next generation will have this, right, to, right? See to see the buildings was already, was already there. there. So this is our work at the moment. And I hope we have more support, support from the society and the public too. It has been very challenging sometimes. And, and, and controversial sometimes. And, uh, and uh, from, the from the government point of view, we hope to bring everyone together. together. And there, are there are different opinions and advices. But the problem is, how do we embrace different opinions and advices? So, thank you very much for coming